What's required to perform SBRT treatments for localized tumors? Stereotactic body radiation therapy requires a whole team approach in order to, to be successful. Usually we consider ourselves a team of excellence that includes a, a dedicated stereotactic body radiation therapy a radiation oncologist, a physics team, nursing team, radiation te technicians, as well as supporting staff. Having this team uh, allows us to uh, maximize our ability to target these tumors. For example, at the time of what's called mapping or simulation, we use any and all types of imaging that's available in order to localize your cancer and your normal organs. That may include a CT scan, a PET CT scan, MRI scan, and more importantly, what's called a four-dimensional CT scan, where the fourth dimension is time. By using this type of four-dimensional CT scans, we can um, map the movement of your tumor as well as normal organ and basically make a movie of your body in the region where the tumor is. By doing so, at any moment in time, we know where the tumor is and thus we can target it as precisely and accurately as possible. After the CT scans are done, a radiation oncologist like myself as well as our physics team then strategize on the computer system in order to maximally target this tumor with radiation doses as well as reduces the radiation dose to the surrounding normal tissue. After the plan is optimized and to my satisfaction, the treatment will be scheduled. At the time of the treatment on our machines, highly technical such as the Novalis TX, we have the ability to take x-rays as well as uh, CT scans, otherwise known as cone beam CT scans, as well as the infrared system, all utilized to, at that moment in time, uh, move you and, and to the position where we anticipate the tumor was at the time of mapping. All these uh, approaches allow us to be as precise and accurate as possible to within one to two millimeter right before radiation beam is turned on. That is how we are able to achieve the type of local tumor control and tumor cures that we are able to with this technique and have minimal side effects and complications to the patient.